In this video, I'm going to give you a few ideas for affiliate marketing. This is affiliate marketing for beginners. Let's get started. Hello YouTube, it's Alston and welcome to my channel where I help you find success online. Be sure to like, subscribe and ring the bell if you are interested in different tips and tricks on how to find success and make money online. All right, so as I just mentioned in this video, I'm going to give you a few ideas on how to get started with affiliate marketing if you're a beginner. Now, if you're like me, you knew that you wanted to get into affiliate marketing, you knew what affiliate marketing is and how to get started. You were just a little confused about the, the process, about the, the beginning steps. In my mind, there there are really only nine simple steps to get started with affiliate marketing, but the first step is probably the easiest and most difficult. And I'm, I'm gonna spend a little time telling you why it's easy and difficult and how to overcome it. The first step, which I believe is finding a niche, is easy because everything is a niche. Everything that you see around you is a niche. Everything in the world that can be bought and sold is a niche that you can take advantage of with affiliate marketing. Obviously the biggest niches out there are health, wealth, relationships, and technology, but everything is a niche. Easy and difficult to wrap your head around that at the same time because everything that you see, this webcam, uh, this computer, everything is a niche, but then you have to kind of figure out which one's right for you. You don't want to get stuck creating content in a niche that you don't care about because it's very easy to get burnt out. It's very easy to quit when it gets difficult and it will get difficult, but it's very easy to give up. And so you want to find something that you care about. You don't have to be passionate about it, something that you remotely care about and something that will make you money online. Now, while everything is a niche, you don't want to target things that are too small, that don't have a great return on investment because that's going to lead to you getting frustrated. Now, I wanna tell you how you can find a niche pretty fast. It'll take you maybe two hours uh, at most to, to find a niche that you care about that'll resonate with you and it'll help you create content. What I want you to do after this video is over, walk around your house and make a list of 10 things that you recently purchased. Now stay with me here, this sounds like a crazy idea, but but stay with me. The reason why you're going to write down the 10, and it can be anything, if you purchase doorknobs, if you per purchase salary, if you purchased um, a, a new window, if you purchased, for for example, in the, in the past month I have purchased uh, a new microphone, this is a Blue Yeti, uh, a Blue Yeti microphone, I purchased soft boxes, I have purchased um, obviously I've purchased food. And so these are all different things that you can create a niche around because there are questions. People are looking for answers. People are looking for assistance. And that's what makes a good affiliate marketer is someone that can answer questions that can provide assistance. Once you do that, you tell people to click the link in the description, they click the link, they buy the product, you get a commission. But you need to figure out what's important to you, what you feel comfortable creating content around. As I mentioned in the past month, I've spent money on, on a new microphone, on software, soft boxes, on food, um, and just a variety of different things, a green screen, maybe a, a new floor mat for my, my chair. These are all different things that you can create content around. Now, now that you have a list of items, I want you to take a look at your recent search history. What questions did you ask or what questions did you type into Google about this microphone? Um, what type of comparisons did you do? These are all different things that are gonna help you decide what type of content you wanna create. If you found yourself doing a lot of research on let's say the microphone here, it's a pretty good example. Let's say you did a lot of research about a microphone, but now you have lots of knowledge. Maybe you've compared two or three different microphones. Uh, maybe you were looking at microphones by price. These are all these are all different things that other people are asking. If you ask these questions, you are now in a position to answer the question because you have done the research. Uh, so basically that's what you're going to do. You're going to make a list of 10 things and then you're going to check out what type of research you've done. And then you're also going to figure out what helped, what hurt, and this is how you're going to create your content. Uh, when you think about it this way, when you look at recent purchases, finding a niche, which can be difficult, is very, very easy. What were some of the pain points that led you to purchase a new microphone? I remember one of my recent videos, it was popping, it didn't sound as crisp, um, it was catching a lot of background noise, and so I wanted to find something that was a little bit better, something that could uh, was a little bit more clear, something that could uh, not catch the dog barking. If you listen to some of my other videos, my older videos, you can hear when my dog is barking, and I really wanted to find something that could eliminate some of those other things, and that's how I settled 
on this microphone. And so that's basically what you're going to do. With affiliate marketing, you're going to create content around someone's pain point and frustration. You may want to create content, maybe it's a video, it's a blog post or a podcast about the five best microphones that eliminate ambient noise. That's different types of content people are searching for. Now, once you have this list, again, once you have this list, you're going to look at your your search engine, it could be Yahoo, Bing, DuckDuckGo, whatever you choose, and figure out your most recent searches and if it resolved the problem. From there, you can address the other the other portions of affiliate marketing, which are picking a niche, keyword research, content creation, email marketing, affiliate programs, and analytics, you can address those at a later date. But again, the easiest and most difficult thing for a new affiliate marketer to do is to find a niche. And with my suggestion, jotting down 10 ideas or, or 10 things, 10 recent purchases, you will be able to quickly find a niche and get on to those next steps. So if you want to learn everything that I know about affiliate marketing, click the first link in the description. In addition to learning everything that I know about affiliate marketing, you'll also get a free guide to email marketing. Now, if you know anything about me, if you've watched any other video on this channel, you know that I'm a huge proponent of email marketing for a number of reasons. One of the biggest reasons why I love email Email marketing is because it gives you the ability to follow up with customers and add additional value. So for example, if you join my email list and you want to learn more about why I, I like this microphone, I could continue to add value over a span of three, six, or nine days. In addition, you can retarget them for other uh other products and services. So if you purchase the mic using my affiliate link, I can come back and offer a pop filter or a stand or lighting because I know that you are creating content, either YouTube videos or blog posts or podcasts, whatever it is, you can retarget people for additional products and services. And finally, we know that it takes between five and 12 touch points before a customer becomes a buyer. And so it's very easy to continue to add value and get people to buy if you get them on your email list. So that's a long winded answer to tell you why you need to get this email marketing guide. It's a free guide. All you need to do is enter in your email address and you'll get that free guide. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.